Hello Libras and welcome to my channel, the Girl Goddess 1111. Today I'm bringing you your weekly Twin Flame Soulmate love reading as well as your general reading in regard to work, family, home, and anything else in between. So, oops. We will get started here right away. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the week of January 4th through the 11th, 2018. Spirit and Angels, what messages do you have for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus this week in regards to their home, their work, their overall outcome of the week? What messages do you have for them? Okay. Oops. Whoa, way too many. Okay, wow. Libras. Awesome. Okay, so when it comes to your work card, um, you have the Two of Swords. So some of you are trying to um, decide which career path to take, what if you have more than one job offer, whether to stay or go. There's some some uh, debate within your work that you are having to face this week. At home, you have the Hierophant in reverse, which reflects on um, the people in that you are connected to through your home life. Um, some of you may be having troubles within a marriage. Um, some of you may be more traditional than your partner. This... Um, Yeah, for a group of you, um, you could be having problems within, um, oh, what am I trying to say? Like your values, like people are doing things that you would not necessarily think are right. Okay. And then the unexpected is the king of wands. So somebody um, is coming into your life that um, is going to bring you to a level that you've never been to. I'm going to have to clarify that because I'm not sure what spirit means by that. And your role is the lovers in reverse. So you're not wanting to make a choice. Um, the lovers uh, in a non-love spread is a choice between two things which is what you have up here in work, but your overall outcome of the week is the world. So things are coming into completion. Um, you are having new beginnings. Let me clarify these quick. Okay. Spirit and angels, what clarifying card do you have for the two of swords here in the job area? Oops justice so you're you feel like something is unfair out of balance um and you have a choice this could be whether to stay or go and the ace of wands is it is telling you to go you will have a new fresh beginning where you can be passionate about the job that you're doing and the hierophant is now clarifying the hierophant. <laughs> can i get another clarifying card for that spirit the lovers. Okay, so somebody is going through a hard time in um, their marriage, and they have to decide whether to stay or go. They have to decide. Ooh, too many cards. Oh, spirits tell me to take them. Okay, so you have the death card here. So I'm seeing this marriage is ending due to um, lies and deceit and being feel like felt like. Um, Things were done behind your back, and they more than likely were because there is the moon here. Secrets, um, hiding things from your partner. So, whoa, what did I do here? <laughs> um, so, yeah, I do see that um, some of you Libras are having a marriage end. <clears throat> Can I get a clarifying card for this King of Wands, please? For the unexpected... Um, for those of you who have been putting in hard work, 
into your life. Um, you could be getting out of memories of your um, past in regards to who you shared your cup with. Well, this is kind of turning into love in itself, too. So um, you're going to have somebody come in who's a fire sign, um, your soulmate, who you are going to offer your cup to. Um, or, no, the unexpected is you are married to a fire sign, Libra. You are married to a fire sign, and they are coming back wanting to fix this marriage. You guys are in separation right now, and they are wanting to fix things. Um, for the lovers in reverse, your role. Oops. The hangman. You're thinking about it. You're not ready to make that decision yet, but you are filled with love for this person. You do love this person. Whoa. My cards are just flying everywhere today. We'll get one more on that. And you are going to start opening up to them. You have been blocking them, not like uh, with words, but like emotionally, you've been shutting yourself down. Can I get a clarifying card on the world, please? The two swords just tried to pop out there, so we'll see if it pops out again. Can I get a clarifying card on the world? The page of pentacles in reverse. So you're unsure. Judgment in reverse. So you're not making a choice yet this week, Libra. Um, but I do see you um, moving on single. I do see you turning down this offer. And you're going to spend time working on yourself. So that is what I see for your, your all-around general reading. So, not too bad. Um, it just seems like you're in a in the thinking phase right now, Libra. And we will go on to your actual love reading. Single Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the week of the fourth through the eleventh. Spirit, what message do you have for our single Libras? Yes, I wanted to come out. The Knight of Pentacles in reverse. So, um, those of you who just gotten out of a relationship could be with an Earth sign. Um, you are holding off on really doing anything right now because in the past you've had the Seven of Swords in reverse. So there was uh, there was lies and yeah, sneaking around. And you just don't trust anybody anymore. you got the Nine of Wands here in the future. So you remain to be very dis uh, uh, defensive. Nine of Pentacles in reverse. So somebody um, is still obsessed with you, though, Libra. Um, temperance, though, you are working on finding balance in your own life before you worry about a relationship. Because relationships just tend to frustrate you. <laughs> um and you're still caught up on this uh, fire sign that you were with in the past. And you're, you're confused about whether to, um, whether to give them another chance. Because they are in back knocking at your door um, with the King of Wands. So yeah, um, I do see you staying single, Libra. I do not see you taking this fire sign back or starting... Any other new relationships this week? Um, you're just too hurt. You're um, untrusting and uh, you just don't want to put yourself out there yet. So keep working on yourself and get balanced and and uh, and you'll be ready in no time. So for our married and married and exclusively dating couples, spirit, what message do you have for? Our Libra married and exclusively dating couple this week in love. Oh, 
Okay, the two of swords in reverse. So here we are again. Um, you have to make a choice between lovers and you don't want to do it. Um, in the past, you have the magician. So you have been um, possibly manipulating um, somebody, this person, or them, you. You are using mind games on them. Um, Ace of Wands is in reverse here, so I don't know. I don't see you starting um, a relationship or staying in this relationship with this fire sign. Um, Five of Pentacles. So you feel really betrayed by them. Your Ace of uh, Chalice is in reverse and High Priestess. So um, your intuition is a little off. You may be um, being misinformed by somebody. There are rumors people are telling you intentionally, so you will break up. So they will break up this marriage um, and it's causing you just to feel empty and drained and really betrayed. Um, spirit is warning you to not always believe what you hear. You have the sun here. So there is um, there is hope for this uh, relationship and spirit is just um, reminding you, you have the strength to get through this. If you want this, it is yours. Um the knave of chalices is in reverse, so you are starting to get over that hurt of that betrayal of that third party. Um, I do see that third party is gone. It is over. One more row here. The knight of chalices in reverse. So you are holding off making a love offer, but uh, because you still feel that there is somebody or the, the person from the past is still in the picture. And the Empress is here in reverse. So um, I'm going to clarify that with the Ace of Swords. So you're going to get, you're going to find out the truth. Um, but I honestly feel, Libra, that they are, there is no other third party right now that is in the past that is over. But you are going to come um, across the truth of the matter. And you're going to be able to make that choice for yourself. But it shows me this week, Libra, you guys are not choosing yet. So um, you're still in that hangman uh position and really weighing out your options. So just take your time and do what's right for you. And I hope you guys have a wonderful week and I will see you next time.